In this session, we will be learning about the need of best practices of coding standards and how important it is for an organization. Best practices of coding standards can be defined as a set of informal rules followed during build period of an application to improve its quality. It helps us in maintainability, dependability, efficiency, and usability. Some of the common best practices include using meaningful names that would give a sight to the item that is represented by the variable. By naming the variable A, B, C, etc., it will be impossible to search and use it further in the application. In naming functions and variables, original Hungarian notation for programming is used. This specifies that a lowercase abbreviation should prefix all variable names with the remainder in upper camel case. When naming a function, we should be capitalizing the first letter of every word in the function name. This is also called camel case writing. Variable names must be chosen to masquerade as mathematical operators. Choose variable names with irrelevant emotional connotation. Variable names should be chosen with respect to the item they represent. This helps in longer usage of the variable without any conflicts and also people who haven't worked on the application will be able to understand what they represent. It should be also kept in mind while choosing variable names when using a alphanumeric words. Always use capital letters after the numbers so as not to confuse some letters with the numbers with their similarity. Comments are always used while writing quotes for applications. Writing comments helps other team members or people working outside the application to understand the code better. It primarily indicates the author of the script along with which functionality the snippet represents. Sometimes during tricky areas of coding or complex functionalities, each step is commented so as to give better understanding and perspective which helps the maintenance team immensely. Prepare your code with variables that are never used and methods that are never caught. This helps in no confusion for maintenance team between variables that might have been used earlier but no longer effective in the code. This is also called red herring. Advantages of best practices include accountability, enforcing coding standards, ensures correct systems are being used while disadvantages include hard to enforce including lack of time. Thank you for attending this session. We will be back with some more interesting topics.